Haiti sits atop a short list of nations so impoverished that starvation is a norm. Life is cheap here, even before an earthquake that takes life and limb. Haiti is reeling after being struck by a massive earthquake. The presidential palace had collapsed. And a disaster of this magnitude could well be an unfolding catastrophe. It was very traumatic. The hospitals were filled to the brims. Amputations were being done left and right. As soon as the earthquake happened, I knew I wanted to come down to Haiti. We were sending down surgeons. We were sending down therapists whomever was available to go help the people of Haiti. I didn't sleep for days. I couldn't. I, I just kept going. The supporter came through and really uh, allowed our prosthetic program to take off. These are literally her first steps. In the future, it will be a better day for Haiti. Wilfred approached and, you know, we would like to, to do a soccer team. It started off with a handful of uh, six to eight guys. Um, today we have 38 members who practice regularly and are part of the team. My dream is become a reality, to get the team to travel to the United States. What is going to be for us? For them to come here and be able to show us this, it's humbling, it's motivating, it's inspiring. They're survivors. I mean, the things that would kill us, don't kill 